as you start to think about it. Here's what's happening. All of these smart devices connect to social media, and social media is a SaaS app. Skype and Facebook and, and Twitter and YouTube, those are social media that come to you through cloud computing that you interact with on smart devices. And the potential now is, as several of the other speakers have said, in a networked world to collaborate, to come up with new ideas, to create new products, prototypes very quickly, see if people like them. If they like them, make more of them. If they don't like them, you don't have to worry because you didn't invest a lot of money and you can move on to the next thing. And what this means for people in the IT industry now in your companies, and certainly in America, there has been a lot of debate, and I certainly have been a participant in some of that debate about how it's going to change the way the IT world works, and there are many IT people that are understandably worried about the cloud because they fear that there will be data security problems, and they also fear that they may lose their jobs and all of these things are true, and yet none of those things are reasons not to move to the cloud. So when we start to integrate the existing computer systems that we already have inside of our companies, and then integrate those with cloud computing and smart devices, what this really does is it makes us all more powerful. There are new skills to be learned, so we should not worry so much about holding on to the old skills because those things will inevitably fade away and we are much better off learning the new skills and entering into a world now where we become networked and we become much more responsive to the way the economy changes. I think what this means is that we are going to have business networks. And again, I am only saying things that other speakers have already said. But when I think about it, and I am a, I am a computer person, I, I think about these things, and my wife sometimes wonder, why are you thinking about these things? But it's on my mind. So I, I see a world where the cloud will become a collaboration platform that enables us all, just like this previous example, to come together, work on new ideas, and then I believe that in individual industries, like in the pharmaceutical and healthcare industry, in, the man in different manufacturing industries, in, in government, in education, that there will start to emerge dominant cloud networks that successful companies will want to participate in. And there is a huge opportunity to create the ways that companies will connect their individual systems to the industry networks that become successful in their markets. And this is where anyone in the audience who is in the IT world should start to think about this. Right now, when we connect our companies electronically, most of the time we are still using EDI, electronic data interchange. And there's, EDI is still a fine technology, but it is a slow technology. It is very complex technology. And it is also a technology that is about 30 years old now. So the cloud offers us ways to do things faster and for less money. And we should start to think about how would we use cloud computing to connect the internal systems of our companies into the industry networks that will start to drive the success in the markets that our companies participate in. 